Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix brightness slider missing in Windows 11 and Windows 10. The very first thing that I would recommend that try running some kind of a scan on your PC that will find out some corrupted or some integrity violation on your PC or laptop. So click on your search box of Windows 11 or Windows 10. Type here CMD. Then from the suggestion, choose run as administrator. Then click on yes and the black window will be coming up. Here type a command that is SFC space forward slash scan now. This command you will also find in the description. You can copy and paste here. Once done, hit enter. Now this command will take some time. So what we can do, we can minimize it and proceed with the next step. Now in the next step, you have to disable and enable your generic PNP monitor. So on your Windows icon, make a right click on it. And from the list, choose device manager. The device manager box will be up. Here you have to look for the monitors. Double click on it. And here you will see either integrated monitor or like something like generic PNP monitor. So just make a right click on it and choose disable device then click on yes and then wait for some time again make a right click on it and choose enable device once you are done now again you have to look for display adapters double click on it and now depending that what kind of graphic driver you are using it can be AMD Nvidia or Intel Make a right click on it and choose update driver. Then you can go with search automatically for drivers. And if the updates are available, it will automatically update it. And if not, then this will give you this message. The best driver for your device are already installed. After doing this, click on close and check back that if the problem is fixed, if you can see the slider on the very right hand bottom that is here. Check back if the brightness level slider is back or not and if not then I would also recommend that try updating your windows. On your search box type windows update and from the suggestion choose check for updates. And here you will see that there is an, a message that says restart required and my computer has been already updated but it needs a restart to complete the updation so what you have to do if in in case if you also get the same message you have to go with a restart or kindly click on check for updates let the update get downloaded and installed and after that finally make a restart and this is a very effective solution so do not ignore this solution once you are done check back and still if you have the issues then what else you can do, you can also try restarting the display enhancement service. So close everything on your search box type services. From the suggestion choose services app. The services box will be up and here you have to look for a service called display enhancement service. So keep scrolling down until you get it. Display enhancement service. Here it is. Double click on it. Now you have to click on a stop. Once it's stopped in the startup type, you have to make it to automatic and then again click on start. And once it's been done, click on apply, then click on OK. Now restart your PC and check back. I'm very sure that the problem will be fixed. So that's all guys. Let me know that if this worked for you and if yes, please consider subscribing to the channel. And still, if you have the issue, then please let me know in the comment section. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.